You have been supporting WHO's regional office for the Eastern Mediterranean for many years now in the area of animal-human interface. What advice would you give to countries if they want to use influenza as a vehicle to strengthen surveillance for other zoonotic infections? Right. Um, um, influenza is one of those zoonotic diseases that occur at the human-animal interface that have been gaining a lot of attention. In our region, I think a lot of attention started um, uh, to be paid for influenza when the avian influenza came into our region, um, and that's um, basically in 2006. Um, following that, a lot of um, activities started to happen, um, and when we had MERS as well. Um, the WHO also, um, um, or parts of the IHR that the WHO aims to implement, have a lot to do um, with One Health activities. Because most of the work that has been done under One Health in the region has been towards influenza, I think that all the countries here um, can build upon that experience um, to really expand into other zoonotic diseases and other emerging viruses as well. You mentioned One Health, which is WHO's uh, approach to better public health. How do you think such conferences contribute to this approach? Um, One Health requires input from clinicians, public health people, veterinary health people, veterinary health practitioners, academia, public sector, private sector, and so on. Um, conferences like this really bring everyone together. So here on the panel we have um, clinicians, we have a session on zoonotic um, flu, we have um, policy makers, we have um, people from international organizations, and we have people from academia, and I think this would be a great um, platform for all these people to come together to know each other um, um, and learn from each other's experiences. And my advice for, for the countries um, is to really understand that when it comes to One Health, um, no one has the experience on their own. So they really, really need to know and learn how to work with, um, with each other and really seek out all the expertise that are available for them in order to have a successful One Health platform.